That water feels good. There we go. All right, I gotta paddle a little deeper because I need to push down the Seat is down. I'm gonna use this tool right here to push down the kayak cart. Let's see. Huh, there we go. It's actually pushing it down pretty good. All right, it's locked. Push down and then to the right. There it is coming out of the other side. There we go. Push it down again. That worked perfectly. All right. I say I'll be using that again. It takes a little bit of coordination, but it'll do. But tell you what, if it's gonna be like this all day, it's gonna be a nice day fishing. Nice out. Mm -hmm. Wow, that wind kicked up, didn't it? Well, I mean, it's up to you how far we want you want to go. Well, I, I say, uh, kind of as far. Yeah. As far into the current as I can. Yeah, I mean, go from there. I'll go with wh whatever you're comfortable with. So. Well, be, it should be an easy way on the way back. Oh, on the way back, we'll so, just drift. Yeah. So for sure. Actually, it doesn't, it doesn't seem too bad, I guess. No. And the thing is, like, if we pass that cove, there's usually shelter over there because of the, um... Yeah, it's usually calm right there. Exactly. So if we can just get to that cove over there, there should be some pretty good protection from the wind. Is it bow fin? Yep, I see it. Oh yeah. You need a net? Okay. Let me know if you need the net. I'll hurry over there. All right, I'm coming with the net. Coming around to. You got him? You know what? Yeah, let me net you. No, oh! It, doesn't, it didn't look like I, I had it. Good. Let me try it one more time here. Oh, that's a good size, bro. He's got the line on his mouth, too. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Let's see if I can get it right here. Yeah, no worries. <laughs> He'll get you what? Pretty good. Here, you want the net? Yeah, just hold the net and then, uh, there you go. You got it? There you go. Give you more control there. There you go, buddy. Oh, yeah, she's trying to get you in there. There you go. I'll get the net ready. You got this one? Let me see if I can try her. Yeah, on. go try and. The last thing you want is for that um, hook to come out and then pop you in the head. Yeah, oh, it's got nasty teeth. Yeah. yeah. I finally hooked one. There you go. <laughs> on a chatterbait too. Yeah. I gotta get on the board here. You got like what, three, four fish already? Well, I landed two. There you go. So, Damn, I'm I gotta, I gotta. Though. I gotta get going here. I don't discriminate for sure when it comes to them suckers. They're just as crazy as the uh, mudfish. Oh! Oh no, damn, that was a big one! Is that bass? No, uh, mudfish. That sounded like bass. Yep. 
I made the right choice. I switched to my my shaky head with that uh, dark worm on it. Okay. Damn. I thought I'd finally get my fish. Got another one? Okay. Ah. I think we doubled up, bro. I got one too. Oh, it's a bat. There we go. Finally fish on. All right, guys. Healthy bass on a shaky head. Look at that. Shaky head. Let's get a measurement. I'm going to put her on the donkey leash, get myself out of this situation. Because I'm in a very narrow corner. There we go. Put her on the donkey leash. There you go, dude. There you go. Bass? Oh no! <laughs> Damn, I thought it was bass over there. You can land this one. Oh no! That's what I love about that hog trot or that um, donkey leash is if I don't have anything ready to take a picture of the fish, yeah. I can just drop the fish. I think she's a pretty good pound and a half, maybe two pounds, so I'm going to have to weigh her. Uh, fourteen and a half. One pound, ten ounces. Almost two. Alright guys, fourteen and a half. One pound, 10 ounces. Got one. Oh, I don't know what this is. Fish. I wish. Yeah. All right, chill. I really don't care if you break off right now. I don't want to mess with you, but you'll be my first mud fish today. Here I am, about to lip it, bro. <laughs> I thought it was bass at first because it started running towards the boat and I was like, okay, could be bass, I don't know. Yeah, it looks like a, it looks like a bass here. Alright, mud fish. I'm not going to bother measuring it, but I will get my lure back. There you go, mud fish. There you go, buddy. Is that a bass? That's a big one, bro. That's a PB right there. We're going to weigh that sucker. All right, I'm coming in. There you go. Where'd he go? I see the bubbles. He's certainly not, he's certainly not giving up. I'm trying to wear him No, he's not going to. Oh, my God, that's big.
you just attach the, the scale on your... Uh... Yeah. I got to um... What's the word? Um... I got a clip on the CP can paddle this way. Yeah. He'll be fine. He's fine. Yeah. He's hooked pretty good. He's not going to just keep pressure to it so he doesn't yep. get on the line. And I hooked him in the upper lip too. Yeah, good hook set too. There we go. I was hooked on the, your paddle there. There we go. Yeah. Whew. Bro, that's a PB. You got to post with this. Oh my god, look how thick that sucker is. So you're not shy, just grab that. Mm -mm. Just keep your fingers away from the the mouth there. Okay, okay, baby. It's gonna be okay. It's gonna be all right. It's gonna be just fine. Just don't flail. There we go. Got your little back there. You got it. That's a clean catch too. Zero doubt. Five. five pounds, uh, one ounce. Dang. Five, five, two. Let's just say five, two. Five pounds, two ounces. That's a good deal. Yeah, that's a, that's a good one, bro. All right, let's get a link. You on said it. you got an eight pounder before. Mm -hmm. I can't imagine what that thing looks like. Dude, it was uh, about twice the width and then about twenty nine inches. There you go. Hold it right there, good, three, two, one. She's pushing 23, 24? Yeah, 23 and three quarters. Maybe. There you go, buddy. Uh, the bow spinner, there's, uh, there's speed on the spinner base. I'm getting a bite like every, every throw. They keep, they keep coming up to the kayak. I threw one out. Yeah. Uh, like a log. Yeah. I saw there was a log right by my kayak. I didn't want to get snagged on it, so I reeled in real quick, but I didn't want anything biting it. Yeah. I, I got into the, to the kayak. I yeah. I was just sticking out of the water, but it jumped out at the lure. Oh, no off. kidding. Damn, all right. Let me put a spinner bait on. Oh, you know what? I don't think I got one, but I have a chatter bait. I might as well put that chatter bait to use. I, um, let me, let, I'm going I'm to try that chatter bait real quick just to see the difference between the two. If I don't get a bite, I might have to borrow it. Oh, mine Golly. I've never caught a fish out in the middle before, so I'm going to try a fish in the middle column here. You are right. Yeah, it's what, the, Yeah, they said it's supposed to be only eight. I feel like it would have been like a wolf pool. I would have put this back on Yeah. I remember the, I think this was the calm spot earlier, right? Yeah. Yeah, I caught a lot of uh see like the bigger boat then? Yeah. But I catch it to be in the middle. Yeah. Right. I don't want to crowd them. Yeah. And like, they're like a great right there. I was catching them. I would take a whole bunch at a time just using that spinner bait. Yeah. Uh, I and mean, I'm telling you, that's where I've been seeing them. Sometimes I confuse them for garb, but it's not. It's bowfin coming up. It seems like the bigger ones are in the middle. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Because, I mean, it's pretty much a channel and they're just on the bottom. And, I'll, I'll see them on the fish finder and I'm like, I'm confused sometimes because I don't know if it's a big gar catfish or a big ass mudfish, but you'll just see like bright humps, solid humps on the, oh, oh, dude, I am hooked up, oh, That. 
big boat fin. Oh, it is? It looks like it. Bro, it's a giant bow fin. <laughs> Bro, this is the biggest. We were just talking about that. I think this might be my PB here. This might be my PB. Oh, please, 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 Lord. Let's try to take my, my rod away. All right, grab my net and see the, oh, I'm just gonna let her peel drag, but I'm gonna try to get her close to the boat here. Oh, sh there you go. <laughs> Dude, I thought I lost her because I didn't know she was running to the boat. All right. Man, that's a big one. That's, woo -hoo -hoo. We were just talking about that too. It's, Man, that's, a, that's at least a six, seven pounder. I hope so, dude. I thought I lost it. All I saw was like a big wake on the water towards the boat. And I'm like, oh, I lost it. Oh, dude, I'm shaking. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just letting her recuperate in the, in the net. That'll calm her down for a little bit. No. Oh, oh. Okay. All right. Okay. On a positive note, she's not hooked anymore. I thought she was gonna get me with that hook. All right. Let's put that away. All right. We got a grip on her. Turning on the scale. Seven pounds, nine ounces. Nice. Seven. Oh, I'm shaking still, bro. <laughs> It doesn't help that I didn't eat breakfast yet. <laughs> I need to eat that snack I got packed away. That's what I'm going to have to do. Oh! 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 I just want to get a nice general idea of her life. Oh, bro. She maxes out the board. 26. 26. 26 and some. Measure her right there. All right. This is what I like about this hog trough. Yeah. Is I can just easily release. Nice. Especially both ends. Yeah. All right, Woodhouse Custom Lures. Crankbait. Oh, here we go. Holy Lord. Oh my gosh, it's peeling drag. What is this? Holy Lord. Guys, I don't know what this is. Oh, oh, stay down, stay down. Oh, dude, it's a needle nose. Oh, oh Lord. Oh, he, he, he got off. 